My question is to the Minister of Transport. How much money has been spent in the past six years on contractors and consultants for light rail in Auckland? Uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, the Honourable David Parker. $66 million. Is it true that after $66 million has been spent on contractors and consultants for light rail in Auckland, not one metre of track has been delivered? And will Grant Robertson's supposed clampdown on consultants and contractors extend to the fa failed light rail ghost train in Auckland? Uh, Mr Speaker, uh, it is true that as with the City Rail Link, the uh, planning and design of those projects uh, proceeds before the building starts. How devastated is he that on the last day of this parliament not one single metre of light rail track has been delivered despite Labor promising it would be built to Mount Roskill in 2021? Uh, Mr Speaker, uh, I refer to my original answer that the $66 million so far spent is less of the likely project cost. Does he agree with the Prime Minister who told Question Time earlier today that light rail in Auckland is a quote, intergenerational project and if so, in which generation will it start or complete it? Uh, well, uh, I think it will be built during that member's uh, lifetime. Uh, <laughs> Uh, <laughs> you are. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Which will be completed first? Auckland Light Rail to Mount Roskill by 2021 or 100,000 Kiwi built houses in 10 years? Um, Mr. Speaker, as previously been said, the, uh, the record of this government on housing is a record that we're proud of, and I'm surprised the member asked that question. That concludes oral questions for the 53rd Parliament.